Hello Peachies, welcome back to Dear Peachy. When it comes to our hair, we're rarely ever satisfied. If we've got straight hair, we want curly and vice versa. Call it hair envy, or a case of the grass is greener on the other side. But it seems we're always trying to manipulate our hair to do something different than what it is. Is one really better than the other? Sometimes you really want to know if curly or straight hairstyles suit you better. But you just don't know how to judge if you are going to look good in either of these hairstyles. And this debate never ends. So in our video today, we are going to help you settle this debate by looking at different aspects. From face shapes, facial features to personal styles. We've got you covered. Keep on watching if you're interested. As usual, this video will be divided into several sections. Please refer to the timestamps for the following parts. Let us begin this section by asking our peaches. What hairstyle do you think will suit you the best? And why so? So what is on your mind when someone throws this question at you? Let us take a wild guess. Here are the possible answers in your head. Answer A. Some of you might think that. Oh, I have a wide round face shape. So I should pick hairstyles that accentuate it to make it look longer instead. Or B. I have rounded face shape and facial features. So I will prefer hairstyles that are light and airy with no heavy bangs, or large deep curls, something refreshing to enhance my style. So which answer is closer to your thoughts, and which do you think is more important to be considered when choosing the right hairstyle? Our face shape or personal style? In fact, both of these answers are correct. The objective of answer A is to enhance our facial features. On the other hand, answer B aims to match the hairstyle to our personal style. There is no right or wrong in choosing either way. If you are a rookie in hairstyling, you should choose hairstyles based on your physical features. Even so, personal style also adds a new dimension to your consideration. So if you have become a pro and developed a distinctive style of your own, or you wish to explore more possibilities in styling yourself, you can experiment with hairstyles according to your preferred personal style. In this section, we'll discuss who would look better with curly or straight hair from the style perspective. Straight hairstyle often gives people the impression of being natural and refreshing. It is effortless. No perming or curling is required, just simplicity. With that refreshing and pure aura, it needs no extra embellishment to accentuate one's beauty. Moreover, natural straight hair that has not been straightened exudes a more warm girly aura. Curly or wavy hairstyles give people a feeling of softness and femininity. It makes one look like they have put in good effort to look good. Or in other words, creating a well-groomed impression. It gives a sense of elegance and maturity. Straight hairstyles highlights the charisma of being natural looking and innocent. Young and refreshing, smart and sassy, or cool and edgy. Whereas, curly hairstyles accentuate the femininity of your appearance. It adds a sense of softness, gentleness, sweetness, and elegance to your style. Apart from that, the charisma of a person can affect the choice in hairstyles too. Some people would look better with straight hairstyles because it enhances their effortless, natural looking and refreshing aura. However, going for curly or wavy hairstyles would mean that the choice of style in both makeup and clothing are diverted to a more elegant, feminine and mature type. Some might prefer this style better, but it also causes you to lose your distinctive characteristics. With that being said, it is all up to you to decide which way to go. Other than the curves or the texture of your hairstyles, the length of your hair and the types of curl pattern can give an impact to your style too. Let's look at the length of the hair first. In terms of the degree of femininity, long curly hair exudes the most femininity, and it follows by short curly hair. Then it's long straight hair, and at last short straight hairstyles is the least feminine hairstyle in this spectrum. If you're still wondering if long or short hairstyles suit you better, you can refer to our previous video here. As for the types of curl patterns, it's more about the size or tightness of the curls. Different curl types will create different styles. The smaller and the tighter curls, the more it will give the retro vibes to achieve that vintage look. Wavy and soft curls hairstyles make you look more glowy, elegant, sweet and girly. Furthermore, the loose and soft wavy hairstyles look more casual and give those languished vibes, which is suitable for anyone who wants to go for a smart sexy look. The figure attached here summarizes how the tightness of the curls can exude different styles. In addition, you will need to pay more attention when selecting your curly hairstyle. Wearing small curls while having the curls at higher positions at the same time will make you look old-fashioned. 
If you don't have a particular hairstyle in mind, then understanding your facial attributes and the kinds of hairstyles that suit is a great starting point to pick the right hairstyle for yourself. You will need to look at your face shape and the proportion. For those who has prominent cheekbones, which are positioned higher and appear more protruded, or the temple region is hollow or less firm, these features can make the outline structure of our face shape to appear more bony. To soften these edges of the bony structure, it is best to stay away from straight hairstyles. Many people age themselves unnecessarily by allowing their hair to fall too flat on their face. Straight hair further highlights the sharpness of the corner of our cheekbones. So if you have face shape with prominent or protruded cheekbones, these wavy hairstyles would definitely look best on you. Curls help frame and divert the attention away from the harsher edges of your face. With the curls, the edges are nicely balanced out and their impressions are weakened, making your face look much softer. Another pro tip to soften the look is to keep the hair around your temple region poofy. You can style it with a curling iron or blow dry with a hair dryer. Elaine Jong's sexiness is highlighted with her new hairstyle. Those lovely curls definitely bring out the beauty of her features. The short wavy or curly hairstyle is also the best choice to soften angular face shapes, like diamond face shape. This curls flatters angular faces because it allows the curls to fall onto the jaw and chin, creating a softer look in these areas. At the same time, your preferred style should be taken into account before deciding on your new hairstyle. Another example we have here is Sana from Twice. Sana has a diamond face shape, but she has soft facial features. This makes her style lean more towards the feminine side. So the wavy or curly hairstyle fits her personal style better because it can help soften out the edges of her bony facial structure. On the other hand, if you prefer cool, masculine or edgy style, straight hair can definitely make you stand out from the crowd. The combination of sleek straight hair with high cheekbones is the perfect combination for creating an air of expensive arrogance. It definitely gives off that mysterious aura that you are not to be trifled with. In contrast, curly hairstyles are less suitable for face shape with stronger and more defined jawline. The common face shape with such feature is the pear-shaped face, with a much narrower forehead and a defined jawline. It tends to shift the visual attention to the lower section of the face. If you have a more prominent jawline, and you would love to keep your long hair. It's best to avoid curly hairstyles. This is because the curls often create volume, making the bottom of the hairstyle visually heavy. Instead, you should opt for a straight hairstyle that looks clean, neat, and refreshing. Texturing your straight hair with layers helps add more dimension to the hairstyle, which look more airy and lightweight. However, there is no wrong for you to try curly hairstyles too. Just bear in mind that you will need to keep your hair around shoulder length or shorter. Also, make sure the curls are positioned at higher levels to avoid it from looking heavy at the bottom. With this hairstyle, not only does it look chic, but it definitely enhances the beauty of your face shape. Besides that, the pin straight hairstyle is a no-no for people with rounded or square chin. They should go for the soft wavy hairstyles instead because those hairstyles accentuate the face shape and add more definition, making the features look more delicate. On the contrary, Face shapes like heart or diamond face shapes usually have narrower and pointier chin. Adding curls to your hair can increase the visual weight of your head, and therefore balancing and rounding out the sharpness of the chin. This hairstyle often gives out a warm, elegant, and girlish look. If you want something different to play up with your features, straight hair textured with layers can divert the visual attention to the upper section of the face, channeling that cool girl boss vibes. There are no rules for this, and it is totally up to your needs in styling yourself. Curls are also your best friend, if you have a protruding mouth and want to accentuate it. This side profile illustration show that lower region of the face is projected forward. However, straight hair fails to bring balance to such feature. The curves of the curls are able to neutralize the projected outline from the side view. For those who'd like to experiment with curly hairstyles, we have another tip to help you identify which type of curls suit you the most. Let's talk about the hippie perm. A hippie perm is a throwback to the big hair trend that was so popular back in the 1980s. And until recently it made a comeback in the East Asian beauty sphere. The hair is permed into small tight curls to achieve the huge voluminous look. However, it isn't necessarily something that everyone is suitable for. Taking Cecilia Liu, the famous Chinese actress as an example, she was once shown up with a hippie perm. And netizens had criticized the look and commented that the styling made her look older and diminish her charm. Despite that one styling mishap, at many other times where she was styled with soft loose wavy curls, her captivating elegance and delicate beauty shine through the most. Why so? As we know, 
Aesthetics is all about balance and contrast. From the many hippie perms we've seen, we find that it looks best on people with prominent or sharp features. The hippie perm itself involves a lot of small, tight and defined curls and waves, and appears more bouncy and dynamic. People with prominent facial features. In other words, having high cheekbones, sharp nose, angle chin, etc. tend to carry this kind of curls best. This is because the sharper features are better at holding up the dynamic of this hairstyle, which in turn amplify their personal style, coolness, sexiness, or their adorable femininity they may be. In contrast, people with less prominent facial features or smooth facial outline often exude a more serene, gentle, and calming aura. Therefore, soft loose textured curls and waves best complement their gentleness, elegance, and daintiness. Defined, small, tight curls with heavy volume are less suitable because they seem too overpowering for their gentle beauty. So, have you found the best hairstyle that flatters you the most? There are still a few little tweaks to take your hairstyling game to the next level. When it comes to choosing a hair color, for straight hair, it is recommended to choose a darker hair color. Lighter colored straight hair seems to give less texture and dimension to the overall look. The curls have higher visual weight, so it can shift the visual attention to the lower section of the hairstyle. To create a fresh look, lighter hair color is your best choice. If you want to play on the safe side, you can never go wrong with the curly long hairstyle in dark brown shades. Still can't decide what color to choose? You can watch our previous video talking about hair color by clicking the link up here. Not only does a different hairdo totally change your look, but it can also work wonders on your hair volume too. Never underestimate the power of curls in creating volume to your hair. The curls can fill up the bulk and give you the major lift. Choosing the right type of curls and curl placement can be a huge game changer to your appearance. Zhu Jingyi and Cheng Xiao both have thinner hair, and it makes them look weary and less eye-catching. After changing their hairstyle, you can see that their hair appears instantly fuller. The puffiness of the curves can also make one's head look bigger. If you have thicker hair naturally, you can request your stylist to texture your hair with layers to take away that extra bulk to make it look lighter and manageable. Layers are a great way to change up a look. Those of you with curly hair may prefer more layering than those with straight hair. Layers can range from short to long, and can either be connected, and all of these can influence the shape of your hair. Curls tend to respond well and behave better when there is not a blunt weight line because layers allow them more movement and bounce, which helps them lay better. A great hairstyle gives you that feeling when you can't stop catching a glimpse of yourself in the mirror. But a bad one can cut through all that confidence. You can choose any hairstyles you want, no matter your face shape. If you want to wear a soft curl bob, go for it. Love straight lobs? We are here for that too. We want you to look and feel your best, no matter what. We hope this video shed light on the different hairstyles that best complement your face. So which style suits you the most? Peaches? Tell us in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video. Goodbye!